see. On finally. Welcome back to Mob Pop Fishing. This is Grandy. If this is your first time here, welcome. Uh, if you're returning, welcome back, guys. So today you will see it's a quick video. Um, I got out with the ice now, the cold weather and everything, and I struggled. You guys can see probably from my energy and everything, I was super struggling. Uh, the main thing is there was supposed to be a hot bite uh, for panfish, for white bass and everything, and you guys will see, it wasn't that hot, but I did catch a few. The main thing was I was able to catch enough to at least feed the kids, so that was kind of my primary goal. Um, I was just using, you guys will see right here, I, I was just pretty much using, I was just using a spoon and metal, metal heads. And also I had a dead stick running too, I was just running off of a minnow. Um, and that was pretty much it. I didn't really switch. I don't know why. That's something I'm going to definitely do more this year. Ice fishing and everything is that I'm going to definitely switch a lot more in regards to what I'm going to use lure wise. So I think hopefully I have a better opportunity to do that using plastics. I think if I would have used plastics, I might have had a better chance. But you know, it's one of those hindsight things, of course. But um, other than that, I, I still had, like I said, I had fun, caught some fish, got a chance to uh, fish with Hawkeye Bassin, Mr. Likens himself there for a little bit, and it was just kind of fun time. So uh, other than that, man, here you guys go. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this short video of me ice fishing for some fish. There you guys go. All right, so I'm out here now. Uh, we're about 27 feet super tame day temperature wise so right next to a brush pile hopefully you can uh, see what we can do See, I don't see anything here. Uh, my buddy's coming out here to meet me, so we'll see. Hopefully I can get on something and just take it from there. I'm gonna fish on me, let's see. Here you go, fish on. Fish on, got a fish on. It is a nice copy, great eater. Here we go. There we go. That's what we're looking for. All right, guys, there, there we go. I'm gonna be feeding the kids tonight, so hopefully I can catch a few more of those and can make a nice little a bucket or two of fish it would be ideal. So there you go. Get the skunk off the board and. Especially after losing that first fish, that was kind of a, a sad, sad state when you lose that first fish. Especially when it was feeling really good too. Alright, so let's see if I can get down there. Take a white bass for sure, and it's not a bad sized one, too. It's not a bad sized white bass. Here you guys go. Nice white bass. It was fun. For sure, fun. Anything? Yeah. Um, I caught three crappie, and they've all been about this size. 
Do you have a tape on you? Nah, I just used my uh. Just want to catch a couple more. Um, not super greedy, just enough to take home so I can feed the family. Uh, I'm not the type of guy to keep a limit. Well, I am. I just got to be able to catch it first. You know what I'm saying? All right, let's see, there's a big fish that's coming up. Oh, oh. oh my gosh. I totally missed a big bite. It almost took my rod. Son of a gun. Oh my gosh. That had to have been a walleye. I guarantee it was a walleye. Man. Oh, he was right there for the pickings. Oh man. Well, that's fishy, guys. That's... Oh. I saw it on the screen, so that's my fault. I, my anticipation was like, eh, it's just gonna check it. I just wait till the, the rod bends, kind of like what it did. If I would've grabbed that rod while that fish was checking it out on my screen, I may have caught that fish. That's my fault. I just didn't, I really didn't think he was gonna bite because so many fish have been coming up to my dead stick and just kind of leaving me, so figure. This is like move number 10. <laughs> so we'll see. I mean, I saw some fish right here. Um, they're just tight lip, guys. I don't know what to say. Gals, you can see movement, so we'll see. Yeah, he just came in and pretty much darted out on me. Fish, but let's see, it's on finally. Finally, fish on. Let's see if we can. Seems like a good size. Ooh, might be a, seems like a really good size, or it could be a catfish or white bass. walleye guys if I can catch him. Oh yeah there we go guys. Oh yeah that is definitely um it was unexpected to catch this guy. I'm not targeting him but I am not about to say no to him. So hold on me. Oh boy that is one of my there we go. There we go guys. Oh there you guys go. Amazing walleye, definitely a great eater. Let's see how many. And that's pretty much it, guys. I caught those three fish, and um, it was a struggle. I was, I mean, obviously, it's a short video, but I was literally there for probably nine hours that day. So uh, it was definitely a long day ice fishing, and only to catch three fish. So uh, it's not all it's cracked out to be. Sometimes you can probably tell by my demeanor or tone that I wasn't the happiest but you know I caught fish kids got to eat there you guys go uh, other than that hopefully you guys enjoyed the video if you did hit the like button you want to see more obviously hit subscribe if not all good uh, but I do wish if you guys check out beer fish fanatics I'll put the link right here myself and fishing kit we just drink beer talk fishing ice fishing open water fishing all the good stuff so and of course we have plenty of guests on there I think we're like almost at 
getting closer. I think we're getting closer to 200 episodes. I think 140 ish or so. So somewhere around there. So check it out, guys. Other than that, man, till next time. Yeah.